A somewhat forgotten classic sees the excellence of execution using every last trick in his repertoire to pull out the victory over Roddy Piper. And WrestleMania 8 sees a rare pinfall loss for Hot Rod, but an even rarer display of professionalism from him makes the moment all the more memorable. Up next on this WrestleMania train down memory lane, we go to WrestleMania 10 in New York City and the first ladder match to ever take place at WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels captured his first Intercontinental Championship with a big win over the British Bulldog on Saturday night's main event in the fall of 1992. But in the fall of 1993, Michaels would be stripped of the championship due to inactivity. As the heartbreak kid watched from the sidelines, Razor Ramon would capture the vacant championship. At the 1993 Survivor Series, Michaels would announce that he was back and that he only had one mission, to humiliate Razor Ramon, who he considered to be a fake champion. Having never been defeated in the ring, HBK still believed he was the rightful Intercontinental Champion. There is only one undisputed Intercontinental Champion, and it is the heartbreak kid, Shawn Michaels. Him on to the down Ramon. It was now or never for Razor Ramon as his grasp on the Intercontinental Championship appeared to be slipping. Thank you.